TSMC pioneered the dedicated semiconductor foundry business model with leading edge technology, unmatched manufacturing capabilities, and customer partnerships, TSMC has established a competitive advantage to unleash innovations in the global semiconductor industry. TSMC continues to invest in R&D to provide the industry's most advanced and comprehensive manufacturing process technologies. The company manufactures over 10,000 different high-yield and high-quality customer-designed integrated circuits every year. These circuits are found in smartphones, high-performance computing, IoT, automotive electronics, and consumer electronics products. Let's look inside TSMC's fab and learn about the IC manufacturing process. A TSMC fab is primarily a large clean room. To maintain the cleanliness of the production environment, entry of the fab is strictly regulated. After passing through metal detectors and undergoing ID recognition, personnel wear clean room garments, gloves, face masks, and shoes. After changing into the appropriate attire, they enter the air wash room to remove all dust particles that could inadvertently be brought into the fab and which could impact production yield. At TSMC, the manufacturing process is closely monitored and properly protected. Raw materials such as liquids and gases are delivered directly to various manufacturing equipment through a maze of pipelines to avoid external contamination. The clean room air conditioning system uses various filters to trap particles and maintain ultra-pure air quality. Temperature, humidity, static electricity, pressure, magnetic fields, and vibrations also need to be regulated. Integrated circuits, or ICs, consist of millions or hundreds of millions of transistors, electronic components, and metal wires that are shrunken down onto one single wafer. As ICs are getting smaller and smaller, their electronic signals are becoming more complex to accomplish an extraordinarily wide variety of functions. How can this seemingly smooth IC have so many components? Let's start at the beginning. To start, IC design engineers use a computer-aided design system to lay out the patterns for each IC's circuit diagram. They use electron beams or lasers to transfer the patterns onto a glass substrate called a photomask. A single photomask represents a layer of circuits. Some complex ICs require multiple photomask layers to complete a circuit's design. The more complex the IC, the more layers it has, and the more photomasks it requires. The raw materials for making integrated circuits are silicon wafers. The production of silicon wafers starts when raw polysilicon is heated and stretched into a cylindrical crystal rod. After grinding and cutting, the rod is thinly sliced into silicon wafers. Doping elements are added to change its conducting power and characteristics. The doped wafers are first fed into a diffusion area that produces high temperature thin films to create insulation properties. These furnaces use precise temperature control and gas flow along with a high temperature reaction to bond silicon compounds onto the wafer's surface. During the chemical vapor deposition, chemical reactions convert gases into a solid state to form the thin film. Wafers are next sent to the photolithography area where circuit patterns are laid out onto the wafer. The process starts with a thin layer of photosensitive liquid called photoresist which is applied to the wafer's surface. A photomask is then placed on top of the wafer and illuminated to create a pattern on a partially exposed wafer. The wafer is then developed by washing off parts of the photoresist to reveal the pattern defined by the photomask. After photolithography, the wafer is sent to the etching area to remove those parts not covered by the photoresist. The remaining patterns are the designed electronic components. 
In the ion implementation area, charged ions are implanted into designated areas to achieve a specified concentration and depth that change the wafer's conduction characteristics and form the prototype of the final component. In order for the integrated circuit to achieve the functions given by the design, these electronic components must be connected with metal wiring. In the physical vapor deposition area, a metal film is sputtered onto the surface of the etched wafer. This metal film layer is then exposed to light, developed and etched again. Materials are etched away to create the correct metal wiring. After each component and metal wiring layer is formed, the wafer is sent to the chemical mechanical polishing area where mechanical and chemical reactions remove material on the wafer's surface to achieve planarization. This helps the subsequent thin film deposition to comprehensively planarize the wafer's surface for the next layer's process. The formation of each layer's structure needs to go through this process cycle and layer-to-layer -layer calibration must be very precise to allow electrical currents to flow smoothly. During the entire manufacturing process, wafers are stacked layer by layer and shuttled back and forth between different processing and manufacturing areas. TSMC took initiative by introducing an automated material handling system in their 12-inch wafer fab, along with an automated timely dispatch system that conducts machine dispatches, wafer handling, and machine processing. The fully automated system allows the entire fab to conduct smart manufacturing and machine learning. Recorded production data provides tracking and error correction to improve yield. After the production model has been completed and compared, it becomes a reference to improve the manufacturing process and maximize manufacturing efficiency and quality. Finally, the IC on each wafer passes an acceptance test and after basic inspections is diced, packaged and tested to complete the manufacturing process. Following production, the ICs are delivered to TSMC's customers to help them realize their product innovation. And through this process, TSMC has helped provide the world with more efficient, smarter, more energy saving and environmentally friendly products that significantly improve our quality of life and promote development of a sustainable environment. TSMC, unleashing innovation.